Good trading streak recently. We have brand new equity peaks in all the portfolios here. Let's take a look at each one of those. 500K portfolio. It includes 78 strategies. Capitalization recommended is 500,000 and it is up 41,000 this month. It went through a drawdown here. We released this in November. We transitioned away from our all 78 right here. I'm going to show you this one. This was the all 78 and it went through a bigger drawdown and we wanted to adjust for that through October. And so we made some adjustments to improve this portfolio and you can see a list of strategies when you click on this. And so um, if you were in this from the beginning of the year, you had a nice gain on the year to buffer that drawdown. And now that we've transitioned to this one, we've reduced our worst case drawdown risk. And so we always find way, better ways to trade and we want to trade with our best strategies that we currently have. And so this is our best setup for the 500K portfolio. If you're going to trade this, I recommend waiting for a 15K, 12 to 15K drawdown and then exiting at a worst case drawdown and waiting. And so that's the most conservative approach. You'd risk 12 to 15K. Initially on a 500K portfolio, about 3% risk. All strategy X is shortlist. We've had this one for over a year. It's at equity peaks, no adjustment. We had, we've had additional volatility in, in um you know, gold has obviously been a tough market and it has caused some of these uh, larger drawdowns. But in general, as we move forward in time, as asset prices rise, you get higher volatility and you have to adjust for uh, larger drawdowns, more capital required or trading a smaller contract like a micro can be beneficial. Let's take a look at the 200K portfolio stock index portfolio. Yeah, stock index portfolio first and the 200K portfolio. This has been one of our top portfolios for the year. There have been no adjustments for this except in July where we switched one strategy with a custom session instead of the .D. And it is up 127K on the year, more than doubling the minimum account size required, $24,000 drawdown. It, it made a worst case drawdown a little bit here in... Um, I guess in February, but in this last cycle, the worst case drawdown held. So the stock indexes have been strong. Quick recoveries, you see the bigger gaps over here where it takes longer to recover. Some of the strategies we're trading now don't work as well going back prior to 2015, 2016. And so those strategies are still included in the results. And you see it took longer to recover when trading some of those, if you would have traded some of those systems historically, so we're trading the systems that work now and after having not made any changes for the past over a year. Let me, let me just show you this. Stock index portfolio 27, December 29th through June 30th of this year. And it had a 28,967. That was changed just by changing our AT2020 custom session. And you can see, um, see the results here. So... Um, Strong performance of the stock indexes and 200K portfolio. Here's our newest and latest 200K portfolio. We've made many adjustments to this. Brand new equity peaks, real money trading. We're still about 5% away uh, from these from the equity peaks in July, uh, towards the end of July, and about 3% on an end of month basis, 2.5% on an end of month basis equity peaks in July. So um, we've gone through many transitions. Gold was challenging, and so it really uh, hurt our drawdown uh, this summer. When and then going into Q3, um, gold was a challenge. You see the transition of additional portfolios. These are all um, some of the transitions you can track and see which strategies were traded by clicking on this. And you can also take a look here. Uh, there's three I've left in this front section. Of the current portfolio so you have easy access reference to those and this one was in a 52 52k drawdown we didn't incur 52k drawdown but you can see um, big spike down gold uh, some of the commodities were the culprits for that and so we've adjusted and we trade less gold strategies now and more stock indexes so 
50k portfolio have not made any changes since January 17th 2021 and its worst case drawdown is held this year it is you can see the cyclical nature of this drawdown curve it's at equity peaks as well up 5300 on 5400 on the month really strong portfolio really conservative approach from the perspective that it doesn't trade a lot you're only trading 10 strategies and you're not trading strategies that trade a lot take a lot of trades and so you can um, you know trading is inherently risky when you trade futures but trading less and slowing down the pace can help you be take a more conservative approach and so the 50k portfolio from that perspective is compared to something that trades a lot is more conservative um, aggressive micro portfolio it's at brand new equity peaks as well at 3900 this month see the increase in volatility increase the drawdown this year and the conservative portfolio is also at equity peaks up 1700 this month so nice gains uh, we recently transitioned this portfolio as well we were trading let me show you which one we were trading we were trading these micro micro portfolios down here and this one we're trading this one August 16th through October 18th and it's still $213 away from an equity peak up 1600 this month you see the spike down with the gold strategies um, and then if you go back and look at the one before that you can see the micro portfolio August 1 through August 16th so yeah this summer we, we struggle with gold and so spike down back to equity peaks though and you know over time we expect our systems to degrade somewhat that's why we make changes that's why we recommend starting on a drawdown buffering a worst case drawdown you could start at a drawdown set your stop loss at the worst case drawdown or give it a little bit of room um, if you want to wait you know if you if you're in a portfolio and the portfolio is really strong and you're waiting for a bigger drawdown it may not get there it may may do well for a while so um, just some of the ways to uh, time the portfolios and trade them but we're at equity peaks in all these portfolios increase in volatility this year in 2021 and we like these portfolios going into 2022 we might make some minor adjustments between now and the end of the year for example I have a Cobra strategy that is uh, that I could trade on one minute charts still testing that and so we'll get that out to you as well so those are the updates uh, latest results through December the 7th I need to change this right here I'll be uploading this portfolio calculator and you'll have access to it today on December the 8th 2021 hey David Bean here welcome to Capstone Trading Systems YouTube page be sure to subscribe to join our community of algorithmic traders we are real money traders. We share our winning streaks, we share our losing streaks, as well as market updates, strategies, and coding tips.